Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm the Marmoset, and we're back with XCOM Enemy Unknown. We're waiting for the Golop Chamber. Golop. 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 To be built. In the interim, we're just kind of waiting for the aliens to show their ugly faces. There we go. Take a look at this. We've just detected a massive new contact. We're picking up an enormous power signature. Whatever it is, it must be fully loaded. We should expect heavy resistance. Battleship. Very large battleship. Annoyingly, it's over there, so I don't have a unit. I don't have a demon class over there. So we might be losing an interceptor here. We're in pursuit. What have we got? They're all over us! Disengaging. Yep. <laughs> Contact detected. Very large. Or just let time come on for a little bit. Yep, yeah, ain't got away. Incoming transmission. Yep. Excellent work, Commander. This council is pleased to see our continued support of this project has been worthwhile. We hope that your current successes only mark the beginning of an enduring effort to eliminate the extraterrestrial threat. Thank you very much, Council. So we've got a grade B because one of the UFOs got away, which is a shame. Um, Remember, we will be watching. watching. Yes. But uh, we can deal with that with the large, large sum of money we've just been the given. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. By building... Reach new fast only costs at 60. Requires a set of those. Manufacture. I would like... Not enough hangar bays. Transfer or dismissed aircraft to make more room. Okay. So we're heading for the hangar. Transfer Raven 1. Hmm. To South... Uh, right, to North America. Alright, so I need... Let's just order as many as we can for this uh, this bay. Actually, that reminds me. No, I need to keep one here, just in case. Um, the thought was I could transfer the one we've already got somewhere else, but I'm aware that if we do that, we can lose it, well, something will pop over our space. So we'll order three. Submit order. And we will order three. EMP cannons to go with them. What do we get from those? Dodge, boost, and aim. Okay, well I'm pretty happy with it as we need with those. We've got satellites with it as we need. Psy armor. Hmm. It's over with light armor, we weren't that interested in it. Mine shield though. Could be useful. Don't need a laser rifle. Don't need any of that lot. Hmm. Mind shield could be something that could be quite useful to put on our psychic trooper. Once he gets some extra things. So let's uh, have the one. We don't have any more ethereal corpses, fair enough. Foundry, any upgrades? Advanced construction. Significant. Vehicle assembly. Okay. Yep. Seven days. Do that. Don't have the Illyrium and the other the ways to do that one. Is already warmed up. I'll make sure to notify you as soon as production is finished. Thank you very much. Mission control. So the firestorms will take fourteen days. Ship transfers. Gollop chamber in six. So most likely we'll get to plot before anything else picks up. Transfer complete. Here comes the gollop chamber. Yeah, because that's not creepy. Glowing orb. Clearly evil. Gollop chamber online. Clearly evil.
Gollop chamber. It's clear that the alien device will not respond to attempts at physical interaction. However, if we can find a soldier with strong enough psionic abilities, we may be able to activate it. Okay, looks like we need to either find someone via our barracks, or we need to... So those people have already been tested, I'm guessing. Yeah. Or we need to get lucky and have someone who comes through get lucky. So, you lot, get stuck in to psychic training. Advanced construction, that's fine. Mission control, all right. You would like plasma pistols. You will give me cash, okay? That's easily done. Engineering. Build by items. Plasma pistols. Manufacture. Build three. Situation room. Pending requests. Dispatch items. There we go. Now I need a greater chunk of money to spend on things I'm not entirely sure. Engineering. Facilities. Build up here. We're using about laboratories, weren't we? Build me. One lab. Build me. Another lab. Alright, do we need any more power? Probably. Build me an access lift. Let's get some digging and some building done. Information control. Advanced construction. Thank you very much. Contact detected. UFO. Nice. Scramble interceptors. Uh, give me a plasma cannon. Pretty sure your plasma gun should be able to take out a large scout. Enemy is padlocked. Don't know what that means. Nice. It accepted very minor damage. I don't think it even actually got hit. So we've got an Ethereal, Mutant Elite, Heavy Floater, Cyber Disc, and a Drone. I'm pleased we don't have the Sector Pod bastard thingy, Death, Ars, Aardvark thing. Uh, that thing. The thing I don't really don't like. Um, and that's our heavy team. I think we will swap out our heavy. For our other heavy. So we'll drop casino and bring moose. So you need Titan armor, normal scrappy thing, rocket launcher, double grenades. Why? Because you're all about making things explode. Um, I'm happy. Do we have medkits? Let's also switch out. Oop. Load out. Archangel armor. Carapace. Basic one of them. Basic one of them. Uh, put that back, would you please? And bring in our other reasonably ranked sniper. We'll be wanting the Titan armor, that beastie, that beastie, and the scope. You don't have the ability to carry, yeah, because I desperately want, I'd, I'd much rather you had the medkits and everything else. Customize your nickname, um, missionary, all very nice, but I'm going to call you Psych. Because you're our primary psychic trooper. And I just, uh, missionary just seems like a weird name. A weird shorthand name for you guys, so I'm pretty happy with that. So, Colonel Watson Wardog is our leader. Pretty happy with the squad. Hopefully, Captain Clean, Lady Ray, will get herself a few more kills and level up. But else that? Ooh, War, Wardog. Wardog, Wardog, Wardog. Why? Load out. Have you got one of those? You really shouldn't. What else could I give you? Scope, don't think you'll necessarily need that. 
You've got a laser that you have. You also don't have a decent pistol at your sidearm, which you should do. Good. Alright, I'm happy with that. Alien grenades, medkits, nano fiber vests. Yeah, keeping you alive just that little bit longer because you'd be much for the better for us. Let's go. On the mission site. Begin that assault. Bumbling ready duck. to deploy. Our AO is within the continental United States. Operation. Bumbling duck. Bumble, 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 quack, 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 bumble, bumble. Explosions! I'm looking forward to putting down some hurt on these guys and getting our psychic trooper leveled up. So, as much as we would like him to be getting shots off with that gun, he will mostly. So, psych will be using psychic powers. Copy, Big Sky. Strike one is clear to attempt the breach. Okay, we look like we might be coming in at a slight angle to the crash line. We'll find out soon enough. No idea how big this thing is, but we've got a nice decent amount of cover to start us off. So, looks like we've got a... Alright, so we're all in one corner. So, expect the potential for trouble to come from a different angle. But let's do the thing we do where everyone moves up. It hasn't pro that doesn't woken up too much. Uh, chest high walls. Anyone? Chest high walls? Yes, more chest high walls. Lots of chest high walls. Why are there so many chest high walls? Because you're playing a fighting game and it's kind of third person. That generally means there are chest high walls. Switch out. The thing I love about War Dog Android is that if anything gets too close, it will just get shot. Simply with the fact that it got too close. Which is a trait I really love, because it means I can put them into very useful positions and be reasonably happy that they're not going to end up in too much trouble. Alright, you can get to there and there, you can get to there and there. Both of you can rest there, there, and there. Okay. Let's bring up the War Dog. No one yet. Let's try to there. You come right over to here. You come right over to here. I could move them to there, but I don't want to. Well, actually, that is an edge. A map edge, so I can pop them up onto there and not be too concerned. So. Be reasonably happy. that as a position. Why not that one? Because I'm pretty convinced I might get something coming in from this direction. I don't want to get caught there like that. 2, K, 4, K, 4, K, 4, K. So, just paying attention to do all the quick keys on this time. Try to get that watch off a little quicker. Lots of trigger noises. Here's the question. Do we attempt the breach, or do we go and see if anyone else is out over here. Hmm. Well, we've got Ethereal, we've, we've got Heavy Flyers. Come over here. And watch. You come around that corner. Get up over there. No cover, no cover, nothing useful. Just pop around that corner then they give me an overwatch there. Alright. As yet. No shots fired. Alright, I think that's the audio cue for... That's the audio cue for pretty much everyone, but I think that first audio cue was the enemy commander. This is our asshole. Enemy spotted. Alright, we've got drone in the cyber disc. Okay. Alright, 
no other new surprises. Alright, you have a shot. Take it, because you need to level up more than anyone else. Kill confirmed. Nicely done. Stacks, stay where you are. You overwatch. Overwatch. Overwatch from the back. And overwatch. We get a nice lot of Illyrium and bits and pieces out of this crashed UFO. Cyber just comes around the corner. We've got three. Overwatch is coming out. All of them missed. It's waking up and having a go. Thank you for that, you unpleasant miscreant. So my cover is now down. So I need to move up. You take your shot first. Thank you, as always. Yep, good mind. 13 point critical, good shooter. Stacks. Come up. And shoot. Well, it's good to know that the inside of the UFO is being suitably reduced. This that looks like a hit to the animations. It should probably blow up and take the drone with it, most likely. Yep, two four. And you overwatch. You also overwatch, so you've just taken damage to armor so far. Not too much of a problem still. Annoying. Hitting grenades being what they are. Ready to engage. Let's rock. Good to go. Let's do this! Oh, yeah! Reloaded. Creepy lady, right? <laughs> Shut up, listen! Two audio six, interesting. Both heavy musons, I think. I'd much rather face them outside. <laughs> the damage we did missing that uh, creature. Fair enough. All right. Dash up. Okay, happy with that. You also dash up. And then everyone else, keep your eyes open. So we've got spent a lot of time in effort building one chest I wore like a brick there and the alien scum they went and blew it up with a scorpion tail flick laser thing shot. Anyway, get up there. Nothing? Okay. Pretty good shot by the enemy making sure the grenade was exactly the right the place it was gonna go. That's fire, don't stand in that. <laughs> No good from you, it will come all you from you standing in the fire. Take the lead there. And we'll have you dash to there. Alright. Inside the UFO, as aliens would be an alien UFO. So I think it's the alien always seems to be um, accompanied by a, a some kind of heavy mouton of some sort. The heavy floaters, I'm assuming, are out in the wilds in the distance. So I wouldn't mind getting some of the guys in the inside first and then being able to shoot out of the UFO, but. 
don't think that's a door, I think that's a wall. Hmm. Alright, so they're all within looking range. So if I have you come here, and I don't like it, you can come back. Okay. Right. Uh, give me a, a run. Going in for the kill. Come up on that door. Away, 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 away. Don't open it. Let's do Overwatch. Yes, everyone else. Overwatch. You don't have anywhere I'm reasonably happy to move you to. You can come up just slightly, give me a little bit more vision. Happy that you've got... yeah, okay, so you can see quite far in both directions. You, on the other hand, my lady, don't have a lot of vision, so it's not quite keeping you back there. Best keep you with the rest of the squad where you can. Provide some help and they can back you up. Alright, which way are we going to go? Well, metagaming, I know that this way leads to the rest of the level. So I'm going to go this way and sweep a direction, meaning that I'm going to go awaken the enemy in an order that I like. So that door... What was that sound? Okay, so we do have someone coming up behind us. I think you have a battlefield scanner. I'd rather be. Alright, come up to there. I've got a visual. Alright, so, fair enough. You guys go and do your thing. You. All back to over here. No shot. No shot. Shot. Let's see how it's going to work on that for these guys. They come round that corner. To try and get a better look at us. Um, come around there just a little bit. So they're triggered, so they sh hoping they'll move up. Game. Yeah, I know they're there. Shh. You hear that? What's making that noise? The enemy. Try to sneak in that way. I'll get him uh, next time. That is not good. Uh, X ray on the move! They're flanking us! Right. 
for his mind. It's like... I don't think you've got a shot there. I'll try flushing him. No, I'll just end up still flank then. Alright, let's um move some people around. Better position to respond to him. He's going to fire on that because you do have a shot. So, run and gun. Going in for the kill. Up to there. And there's your friend. Okay. Run and gun. Moving to fire position. That's not flanked. Kill him. Done. <laughs> nice. Run the same on this one. Get out of there. Eight point critical. If he moves or does anything from that point, I'm pretty sure he'll get propped by the snipe. So, alright, so your guys are definitely in there, so you have to overwatch because no more. You. Lady Grey. Useful, but uh, just go there and give me an overwatch. All right, let's see what this guy does. Trying to move, gets a reaction shot, which gets a miss. Uh, damn it! They're trying to find us. Eight points of damage. Yeah, to be expected. I think I need to get a medic to you. As it is. Good night. Light him up. Quiet. Did you hear something? Right. Okay. We need to get some repositioning organized. So come up to here. Just there you are. Let's switch to that other rifle of yours. Moose. Come up to here. So yeah, basic repositioning so that we can get a medic up to Android. There's another psych or anyone else. Come out right over here. And then we will double time stacks into here as far as we can. Right, so you will give us some cover. And you will give us some cover. So we've got rid of the cyber disc and two of its minions. We've got rid of two of the mutons. We don't have accounted for the elder thing. It's in the middle. They always are. We don't have accounted for the heavy floaters. Guessing they're probably outside. Right. You. Come stand here. Get her Man up, patched up. Get back out there. Thank you. Stacks. Come here. Get her armor patched up. Easy now, soldier. 
Good. Alright. You give me an overwatch. You reload. Reloaded. Overwatch. Overwatch. Alright. So it's in a good flavour and shape. What was that? To carry on going this way. Right. Stacks, where are you? There you go. Okay. Not anticipating anything going too badly wrong, but it does always pay to be cautious. Point that I discovered the heavy floats are all over here. <laughs> and I'm about to get utterly, utterly jumpy and just by them all. But I have no need for my team to be. Names over here right now. So, we'll be breaching that door and finding out who's in there momentarily. In the interim, those you can, keep an eye out. So you can't bring, you can't stun these as far as I know. Alright. Android on that side. War dog there. Psych up here. Lady Grey over here. Could have walked around that, would have been easier on your knees. Stacks to there. Up here. Breach the door in next round. Take the opportunity to reload Let's you. Do this. Anyone else needs to top up? Back online. Yeah, that sounds like it might be heavy floating. So they are indoors. That noise is the. What the hell was that? Elba. Let's get your plasma rifle up. Let's open that door. Got something over here. Yep, there's the elder and his heavy friend. He walks straight into uh, that's not that good. with a double miss. I'll get him next time. And the enemy is flanked. Okay. Really, of all the people not to have a shot, it's you. That's unhelpful. Alright, well, scooch over. And get that out. And you take a shot. I want to hit that one. For a hit, I'll take that. Alright. Let's get that grenade out, so that it doesn't hit the war dog, but does take out as much of the surrounding terrain as we possibly can. Going out. Psych. Mind cook. 0% chance to hit on him. Alright, mine cook this guy. You're gonna wish you stayed home. Alright. I'd much rather you hit and got rid of him. Exposing Putting far on that because that's the guy with the psychic attack. But I might as well hopefully see if I can finish him. Off. Got him. Right. You must have to do some kind of psychic activity. Get out of my head. Yep. Fine. Thanks. 
you've only got a shot on my guy, alright. Not that one, that one. Flash. Flush him out! Clear to engage! I'm running low on ammo! That's fine, everyone now is happy. So that breach went really, really well, apart from the fact that my bloody sniper managed to get herself in a position, well, managed I put her in a position where she couldn't hit anything. So I think the grenade worked well, crashing all the uh, enemy surroundings. So that, I believe, is the heavy floaters. Hear something? Yeah, judging by the uh, floating noise, that is the heavy floaters. Run and gun. Please, Android. Tuck yourself into that corner. You come up and take the other side of the door. It's a real shame we can't get them to come to us. It's like, would you mind? Please? Terribly? Mm, possibly? Yes? Maybe? Could you? No. Fine. Uh, that side of the door will do. Alright, what kind of cover have I got out that way? Not a lot. Not to the end. That'll do, yep, just stay there. We always have the rule of don't like it. If you don't like it, you can always just go somewhere else. Alright, well I've completely destroyed anything that might have resembled cover over there, so just pop up that part. Overwatch. Overwatch. Reload. Let's do this! And you run and gun, so the only thing you can do is overwatch. And overwatch. And you can't switch because you've moved. Yeah, creepy critter noises. What's making that noise? Hello. No way that just happened. Well, we know from the You've got to taking a fair few shots. So your patrol route dumped you into the roof, did it? All right. I'll take five points of damage from that. Finished it off because he got close enough to provoke a reaction shot. Alright. Um, let's not force the flash just yet until we know if anyone else can actually hit it. No, be any answer. Okay. You've got a shot, take it. The extra damage. And for the cover removal. I'll get him next time. You've got a shot, take it. Good work. Psych, come up to there. Fright brain. You're going to reach this. You overwatch. And you shoot. He's down. Messy. Another one down. Good work, Nicely done. Commander. So the episode, Operation Bumbling Duck, ends with a very clean sweep. Though Android did get a little bit of a beating. We did get dumped by those guys at the end. Um, fortunately, my squad is suitably good enough that they were able to take them down. Missed on the overwatches, though. Though we did manage to get one of them down on the action shots. Pretty happy with that. That. We didn't leave Cuddly. anything to chance, and it paid off. Excellent work, Commander. All right, Stax is now a Colonel. Make it restore former health per use, or Sentinel. Allows two reaction shots per Overwatch. I will have the medical, thank you. Psy Specialist. So we have Psy Inspiration. Removes mind frame, panic from allies within three tiles. Strengthens their will, two turns, or psi panic. Causes target to panic on its following turn, the hardest will to overcome. Hmm. Panic, I think. 
getting the enemy to run away suits me. Fortunately, Captain Grey and Captain Clean didn't level up, which is a shame. But we brought in a load of extra bits and pieces. There's the Gollop Chamber. No, nope, no soldier capable of using the device yet. Head quickly to the Situation Room in the Grey Market. And complete the transaction on that. Now, did we... Under construction in five days. Great. All right. So we'll probably be starting off the next episode with that. I've been the Marmoset. This has been XCOM Enemy Unknown. We have defeated a bumbling duck. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe.